Hey guys, we are back with another review. Today, I have a really unique experience planned. I'm hoping. I was invited by Chef Gary to actually try a place that's been a staple of Port St. Lucie for the last eight years. It is called Zen of Sushi. Yes, you heard me right. Zen of Sushi. They supposedly have an amazing play on sushi, and I am really excited to try it. I heard that they have some really unique stuff, definitely doing some fun, playful things with sushi. So again, we're at Zen of Sushi in Port St. Lucie, Florida. Let's see what that sushi working with. Guys, so as you know, we are at Zen of Sushi in Port St. Lucie, Florida. So we're going to be trying a lot of goodies. Chef Gary in the back. We got his wife here. Again, they've been here for eight years. So guys, support small businesses. Which one is this? Just uh, jalapeno peppers. Oh, okay. Okay, all right. So we got a couple of goodies to start out with. A couple of the appetizers. We actually have the Crab Rangoon, which by the way, he said this is nothing like the Chinese crab rangoon. By the way, nothing against that. But again, we're at a Japanese sushi restaurant, so it's very important to know. All right, so guys, we are going to try the crab rangoon, which is only $7.99, and then the jalapeno poppers. Those actually look really good, which is $13. So first, let's start out with the crab rangoon, it comes with, which actually comes with a sweet chili sauce. So he said these are unlike anything I've ever had. We will see. I would say it's very delicate, very unique. I do taste the, the cream cheese in there, but I definitely do taste the crab, which this is this is homemade. Now, normally, I'm not the biggest crab rangoon guy, but these are actually really good, really flavorful. Definitely unique. I think if you're a crab rangoon person, I think you're really going to love this. I, think the, I like the, the crispness on the outside. Cooked really well. So again, $7.99, not a bad value at all. I'm actually gonna go with an 8.1. 8.1 in the crab rangoon. The jalapeno poppers, the J poppers, jalapeno stuffed with cream cheese, spicy tuna, tempura fried with eel sauce, and a spicy mayo for $13. Look at that, that actually looks really pretty. Wow. So again, on the top, you got the eel sauce and the spicy mayo, so I'm gonna jump right in. Wow. When you come in, say hi to Lizelle, and your husband is Gary, right? Yes. Chef Gary, beautiful. All right, wow, that is a pop. I definitely like that. Do taste that eel sauce. The spicy mayo is actually really good. And it does hit you. There was a little spice of that. Let me jump right in. Mm. Let me go one more bite. That is actually bursting with flavor. Look at that. It's like a little boat. Look at that. You know what? You know what? That is phenomenal. That is phenomenal. I'm trying to keep it. I'm trying to keep it cool because this is just the beginning here. The value, the taste, the flavor, that is bursting with flavor. You definitely get the spice from the jalapeno. I'm actually going to go, that's really high, man. I'm going to go 9.2, 9.2 on the J-poppers. All right, guys, take a look at this. Oh, my God. What the? We got the hot lava. We got the cani cucumber cream cheese topped with a baked salmon in a spicy mayo with sriracha sesame oil topped with eel sauce and scallions. So this one is only $16.90, $16.90 for the hot lava. So here we go. So again, this is such a pretty play. I mean, you look at this sushi, and I know I mean it with a fork. Don't bash me, guys. But if you do, just put it in the comments. Ha ha. So the cool thing that I like is it's almost like we're eating a meal. Like this presentation is really like a meal. And that's what I think the play is on Chef Gary Sushi. So here we go. Really looks good, though. I like that. The thing I really like about this, honestly, for all you people that maybe don't love sushi as much, this is almost like a meal play on sushi. Obviously, you take the rice, the cucumbers, the spicy mayo. Again, I really like it. I, I do taste that sriracha. I do wish the sriracha hit me a little more, but maybe as we go, it will. Let's see. Again, you have a really nice play of sweet, spicy. I also like that cream cheese in there. This is really good. The salmon's good. Everything's flavorful. One more bite. I do like salmon. I'm not the biggest salmon guy, but that's okay. For those of you that like salmon and maybe you're not really big on sushi, but you can definitely go with a cooked sushi version of it. I'm still very high on this. I'm actually going to go with an 8.7. 8.7 on the hot 
lava, baby. Again, he's doing a really fun and unique play on sushi. So check this out. Look at this one. We got the crispy kimchi roll, kimchi, avocado, asparagus, panko fried with an eel sauce. So this is actually very popular. $13, $13. So you know me, I'm going to jump right for the big one. Look at that. That is pretty. You know what? We're going to go all in. Guys, the play on sushi, the playfulness of the sushi and the ingredients. Listen, I'm not the biggest sushi expert, but I've been to my sh fair share of sushi places in Japanese restaurants. And it's just so unique. It's so different. And again, if you're a vegan and you want an option where you can eat sushi, this is phenomenal, guys. I'm going to go one more bite. Really good. Really fun. Really unique. 8.5. 8.5 on the crispy kimchi roll. Okay, so now we have something called the typhoon roll. Yes, the typhoon roll. First of all, look how pretty that is. So the typhoon roll is actually $18.90. You can call it 19. It comes with the spicy tuna, the tempura shrimp, cucumber, again, topped with tuna, ooh, salmon, eel sauce, wasabi, mayo, roe, scallions, and tempura shrimp. chips. So we're going to jump right into this. Look at that. Look how pretty that is. That is so pretty. You can tell that that's fresh. And guys, I'm not a sushi expert. This is just coming from my, you know, my perspective of being a foodie. So here we go. Look at that. That is a bite. That is a bite. Here we go. The thing that I love about what Chef Gary is doing is he is taking traditional sushi, which he has been trained in the art of Japanese sushi for 26 years but he's adding a playfulness, almost a way where Americans can come and try it as well, but obviously still bring in the traditional client. Uh, so let, let me go one more bite. That That is that is a, a bite and a half, and it's so pretty. Look at that, take a close up. It's just so freaking pretty. One more bite. Guys, if you're a sushi fan and you haven't come here yet, I'm sorry, you're an idiot. You're an idiot. I'm an idiot too, but that's okay. Uh, so on the Typhoon Roll, the tempura shrimp is so fresh, and I'm telling you, nice big pieces. You could taste everything coming together, the eel sauce, the spicy mayo, and everything. Guys, this is another hot one. This is another hot one. I'm trying to keep it in perspective, though. I'm going to go with a 9.4. 9.4 on the Typhoon roll. Last but not least, oh my God, so look at that. We have something unique. So what he told me, he definitely wanted to give me more of a traditional dish for all of you true traditional sushi lovers. So this is actually called the spicy tuna flour. The spicy tuna flour, tuna sashimi, dripping in spicy sesame sauce, scallions, and roe for $15. So we're going to jump right in this. All right, let me see if I can. Oh, we're going to get the flour. Oh, we're going to get right in the middle. Look at that. I'm going to dip it all in this. All in this. Here we go. So this is traditional. I've never had anything like this. Look at how beautiful that tuna is. Though. Look at that. Here we go. We have had so many goodies here. If you love the traditional stuff, I can tell you this tastes so fresh, so clean. You would love this. To me, being more of a sushi layman, I love the, the fun playfulness. However, on the spicy tuna flour, it is good. Not my favorite. It's really good though. I'm actually gonna give it a 7.5. But guys, if you are ever in the Port St. Lucie area and you wanna try some amazing, yummy sushi chef gary is doing some unique stuff some stuff that is out of the world come in try the place support small businesses i think you'll really really like it so again guys we are at zen of sushi in port st lucie florida that was another review baldy out